Hey guys, welcome back to this week's video. I hope you have been really well and uh, uh, thanks for tuning in. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can remove a background from an image or a photo and then replace it with a completely a new background that is very interesting. You've got the option to uh, choose what background you want. So I'm going to use uh, three different tools. So I'll be quick so that you can learn and go and try uh, yourself. If you're new here, my name is Steve from stevenjohnsy.com. I create videos every week so I can help you learn something new, something that is good for your personal development, and also something that you can use to earn some extra income if that's what you want. If you haven't yet, please subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell so that you can get notified every time I post a new video. I appreciate your support, guys. Thank you very much. As you can see now, I'm on Canva. So I'm going to use three different tools just quickly to show you. Uh, so with Canva, you guys know I love Canva so much. It helps you do so many things. So Canva has got a, a free version and a pro version. Uh, but if you want to remove backgrounds and have all other different tools and the templates, so you can uh, subscribe to Canva uh, for Pro, but I'll leave the link down below in the description box so that you can try Canva for 30 days and then see what you you can uh, uh, you know you can benefit from using Canva. So with the pro version of Canva, you have uh, this tool where we will be using to remove a background. Otherwise, uh, uh, you have to go to a third party um, website so you can remove a background from your image. But I'll just show you because I've got a pro version. So I'll show you how you can do that as well. And then I'll go on to um, show you another website called remove.bg uh, that also helps uh, to remove background and then i'll show you the last one which is really really good uh, it's called the pxlrbg.com uh, so it also for free as well so these other two websites they are free to remove your background and uh, i will uh, show you right now once you're on the home page uh, then you go to your design um, you can create the design that you want i've created this design just from the uh, from the start so i um, I did a custom design, I went to custom size and then entered these um, uh, measurements uh, at 1920 by uh, 1080 and then I came to this um, um, canvas and then I went to photos on the left toolbar here. You go to photos there or you can upload a photo that you want if you have it. Um, I can, um, uh, I'll just uh, duplicate this one and then I'll remove this photo here so I can upload a photo uh, as I said you can upload your photo that you want um, that you know you want to remove the background um, let's see what photo I can uh, let's use that one and then um, um, so uh, as you can that's how you upload a photo from your photos uh, but otherwise you can use the, the photos that uh, Canva has and this is one of the photos that I have I got from from there so uh, to remove a background with a pro version uh, so what you do you come let's say I'll click onto this one um, I will just uh, duplicate it again so that I can show you so we'll start with this one this is the original photo and then this is the copy I've just done so I will, what you do now you click on the photo so you can highlight it and then I'll just uh, close this so you can have more space uh, so this is the photo I've duplicated it and then this is the duplicate copy. So what I do now, I click on it so you can highlight uh, the entire photo. And then on the top uh, toolbar on the left, it says edit image. So you click onto that, then it will bring a menu here. And then you, you've got all different uh, filters there, but we just want this one, the remove background or background remover. So you click on it and make sure it's highlighted. Then you remove the background. So it should take long. As you can see, Within seconds, um, once you see this brush pops out and this apply comes out, you know it's almost finished. So you're doing the final touches, and then bang! As you can see, it's all all the background is gone. Look at it; it's really, really, um, uh, really cool. So if you come here on the left uh, side, you see it says uh, uh, select the brush. So if you feel like there's something that you need to add or remove to make sure it looks perfect, you can either erase whatever is left. Maybe if I want to remove this bit here so you can uh, go to erase or if you want to add something maybe uh, part of the cup is cut you can restore that part of the cup only and then um, it becomes perfect but i'm not going to do anything because uh, this photo looks really really good i'll just zoom it a little bit so you guys can see at the details as you can see it's really really perfect you know look within the hair this lady's hair is all done so that's how you do with canva uh, but you need a pro account as i said on this uh, um, uh, version you'll be able to do uh, this 
um, yeah, and then what you can do, um, you can even add a background if you want. Um, that's what I did before. So, and I'll try that one again. So you can see, uh, let's quickly remove, I'll go to edit and then uh, remove background. So we should be able to, to see that happen. Um, That's it. And now, as I said before, um, you can see here all the stuff is on, but the cup there is um, it's kind of eaten away. <laughs> we got removed because I think it didn't get the real uh, clear uh, cut where it's supposed to cut. So then, what I'll do, I'll click on restore. Then you can change the size of the brush. Um, so you can, then you come here and, and restore there a little bit. size again, Re reduce the size rather, and then let's see if we can, Yeah, it's not really uh, perfect on that one. Uh, it's very tricky, uh, but uh, basically that's how you you, you do it. Uh, some photos, it, 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 you know, it's easy. It comes out nice. Some you have to really work on it to make sure you, you get what you want. And like I said, this one here, you can even add a background now and then see if um, um, that will help. You can add the background there and uh, I think see that one you know you can add or you can even come to backgrounds and add like a proper background let's see if you can do that with uh, the gradient um, yeah or you can even do the shapes you know you can do a lot of things once you've uh, taken the, the, the background uh, uh, but that's basically how you do it with canva the next one uh, that you're gonna do now is uh, remove uh, uh, image or remove BG so what you go you do you go to Google and then type remove.bg and then this page will come up so once you are on the home page what you do it already gives you the, the, the easy quick way of getting to uh, to the image so you just upload image and from your from your photo uh, or folder or from your computer and then it will come up here or you can open your your folder and then drop the file there so what I'll do I'll click on upload and then um, the, I'll get the photo from my images uh, then uh, I'll take uh, which one did I take <laughs> one of them they all fine <laughs> Uh, it's quick uh, so uh, but wait till uh, the end because the next one is even better it's an extra option that is really good with the other one so this is good as you can see that photo there it's gone the background is gone uh, you can uh, in the same way as well if you think you need to brush a little bit like here I might need to brush that um, a little bit uh, but I'm happy with that then you download the photo um, let's download the photo and see and then we will open the photo here and see. Um, as you can see the photo, um, I'll show you even the um, the previous photo, uh, like the original photo. Um, so this one, then you can pop it somewhere or you can take it to Canva and then add a new background as well. So I will show you, and this is the original photo here. So that's how you do it with Remove BG. And the next one, which I really, really like is um, um, it's, this one is PXLR. Uh, it's, it's really, really amazing. PXLR.com is amazing because uh, it takes seconds. You put the photo in and seconds, uh, it's, the photo is just, you know, it pops out uh, already done. So as you can see here, um, it's free uh, and uh, you don't need to pay anything and you don't even need to sign up for anything. And then you remove the background on several images at the same time. So it's got some advanced level that I won't go through to go into. But uh, the important thing is uh, for you to remove the background and then you can tidy it up if you want. But one thing that I wanted to show you um, is um, I'll just zoom uh, close so I can show you this section here. Um, as you can see, um, yeah, this section here says HQ. It says save the results in up to 16 uh, megapixel. Uh, that's like um, um, 
look at that how big it is 1496 uh, by 1496 it's quite a very high 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 quality image that you know um, you uh, can use it if you are into e-commerce and you are you've got a design shop that you, you sell stuff on you don't need to take this photo after you do it to another platform to optimize it is already optimized all you need to do is just take it there and then you put it into your design and then uh, um, put it into your um, your print on demand shop and then that's it you don't need to do anything else because your photo is already optimized so that's what i like most about the pxr uh, it's really really <laughs> great uh, so i will show you uh, as you can see um, all you need to do is just um, open the image and then we'll take uh let's take this one uh, um you see this this is the photo and then it's making uh, it's magic and then within seconds as you can see uh the photo is um it's it's just so quick amazing it's all done then you can um you can uh, uh, touch uh, and fine tune as you go to the toolbar on the right side here you can fine tune and then uh, if you feel like this bit here you want to remove that you can do that so uh, it's easy as well the, the fine tunes are all easy tools to do so I love this it's a high quality image you need to touch a little bit here to make sure it's all perfect as uh, all of them and um, uh, yeah so you now have an amazing uh, photo that you can use uh, and it's a very optimized photo as well so I really like this it's 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 very amazing uh, so I thought you guys who might want to uh, know these uh, websites um, including Canva obviously uh, but I talk about a lot because I love it. it makes it easy especially if you are not um, design savvy so you can use Canva uh, as well um, as I said again I will leave the link down below for Canva for Pro so you can try that for 30 days and then you'll be able to also have this option of moving background and all other different options, photos, uh, videos, music, everything. So Canva has got everything. Uh, but I hope you guys have enjoyed this and uh, please, if you have, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so that you can get notified every time I post a new video. I appreciate uh, your support as I said before and I really mean it. Thanks uh, very very much. So I will see you guys in the next video. I hope um, you'll be another one interesting uh, that you will take it into your Christmas holidays and enjoy it <laughs> and play around with it. So we learn uh, uh, every day and that's why I'm to do these videos. I believe um, you have to learn every day to grow uh, personally and uh, uh, you can share that with other people. So there you go guys. I'll talk to you in the next one. You take care. Bye.